Hey everybody, wanted to share with you guys an article that I recently found, originally shared by my friend Victor Van Rambutan. You can put a link down below to his channel. And it's about how jackfruit uh, researchers are saying that it is a new miracle crop and could be a replacement for corn, wheat, and soy to combat climate change. And I saw this and I thought, yes, like people are finally getting it. Uh, I'm so stoked. I'm going to put a link for the article here. You can read it here, but it just... It makes so much sense to me that fruit is going to be way better than corn, wheat, and soy, which are foods we can't even eat in their natural state, whereas jackfruit, it just grows on trees on its own in the wild. No you know, pesticides or fertilizers or anything like that needed. And instead of creating grass plants like corn, wheat, and soy, you create tree plants, which are far superior for the sake of the environment because they convert a lot more carbon dioxide to oxygen. So more fruit trees is more trees, is more forestation, is less deforestation. We can combat deforestation. We're not, you know, knocking down forests to plant grass fields of corn, wheat, and soy to feed them to animals or just to eat them. We're planting trees, and the trees are growing fruit and providing us with food, and it's win-win-win all around. Uh, so I'm real excited that this kind of stuff is getting into the mainstream. And of all fruits we could do it with, jackfruit, like one of the best tasting fruits on planet Earth. Like if you haven't tried jackfruit yet, go out and get it if you can find it. It's a little hard to find. You may need to go to like an Asian grocery store or something like that. And it may be expensive. I know that um, in most of the United States outside Los Angeles, it's like 2 $3 a pound. So you're looking at sometimes 60 bucks for a fruit because they're big. They're like, you know, 20, 30, 40 pounds sometimes. Uh, I'm fortunate that in L.A. I can get it for a fraction of that price, usually like 75 cents a pound, sometimes cheaper. Um, but it tastes like juicy fruit gum. I don't have one with me right now. You might have seen it in other videos. But if not, go look up jackfruit. And I just wanted to read you a few funny um, uh, little tidbits of this article. So first they say that um, if you eat just 10 or... 12 bulbs of the fruit, you don't need food for another half a day. Well, I don't know if that's true. Um, it's certainly calorically dense, but you need to eat a little more than 10 or 12 bulbs of fruit to get um, uh, your fill. I say just eat as much as you can. It tastes like juicy fruit gum, and when you're full, you'll know it, and just come back for more later. Um, it's easy to grow. It survives pests and disease and high temperatures, and it's drought resistant. So it's like super easy to grow. We don't grow it in the States because it can really only grow in southern Florida, but it's like, it grows like weeds in India. And what's so funny is that they say, um, in its country of origin, India, it is just not understood. There's inferiority attached to jackfruit. Any farmer would happily carry an imported apple in his hand rather than jackfruit. It, it's like, it's considered like a poor man's fruit in India. So much so that like, people, like there's a stigma to it, whereas in like, the United States, for those of people that know about it, because it's rare and it's not like commercially available, like in widely distribution, but people who find it like, oh my god, jackfruit's so good. I have like people that aren't even vegan or fruitarian or interested in that, and I like let them try jackfruit when I have it, and they're like, where can I get more of this stuff? Like this stuff is amazing. I have friends like going around trying to find Asian grocery stores in their neighborhood trying to get some. So uh, I think it's really really positive news. And I just wanted to uh, share this article with you guys and hope you take a look at it, share it with your friends, and let's plant more trees and eat more fruit and save the planet.